Hey, Percy. Hey, Gordon. It's um, time. So I currently have the wonderfully unique problem of needing to learn how to trap myself. Um, as in something that when I die, I will just become trapped. So some kind of bed trap or spawning trap. But the thing is, you know, like to generally test that, you should die to make sure it works. But I can't do that. I just can't because the whole, I, I need to see if I lose my memories when I die. It's like, it's a whole thing. So I can't die to test it. Luckily, there's still a way. You just got to be a little clever about it. Because what you need the game to do is to send you to your spawn point. And you know, if you go through an end portal, it'll send you to your spawn point. So basically, I'm going to I'm going to try and build something that will be a bed trap or a spawn trap. And then to test it, I just have to jump through the end portal a bunch. So we'll see if that works. And this entire plan has three simple steps. So we'll start with step one. Step one, make a bed trap, as in trap a perfectly good bed with obsidian. And I've got a bed, so I don't need to worry about, like, moving my actual bed. I can just place my spawn somewhere else and, you know, set the trap up there. But um, I do think I'm going to need quite a bit of obsidian, so I might as well go shopping for it. Ooh, yes, economy. And I think it would make the most sense to just sort of dig out a room from here. So, you know, I'm just going to do the diggies. Twelve seconds later. So I finished digging out an area, and I went and I put some beams in, because the ceiling was doing the weird thing again where it makes, like, the noise, and I'm like, oh, it's going to come down on me. Um, but this is just, this is, if anything, this is going to be Percy's room, because I'm planning, well, not Percy, he's not going to live here, but I'm planning on digging this down. Oh. Okay. That puts a damper on things, but on the plus side, that means I don't actually have to dig a lot of stone. We can look at this as a very, very nice, convenient thing. This is convenient. This is very, very convenient. Means I don't have to dig out as much because it's already technically dug out because it's water. Okay. Um, all right. Um... Let's just, uh, start in here, shall we? Alright, now I have the problem that I'm stuck in here. But, that's kind of a good problem to have, because I've just built, like, you know, the enclosure for myself, like I'm a zoo animal. Um... Now comes the fun part where we see if I can figure out how to make it so I can only spawn inside this box. So I think this was the side that didn't have water. Yes, okay. So, we're just gonna go back here a bit. Spawn traps work based on the valid spawning locations around your bed. So to make it so you only spawn in one place, you have to set your spawn somewhere and then block off all of the other possible spaces you could spawn except for the one you want yourself to spawn in. And so here I'm sticking it in the corner and making sure I can only spawn inside the obsidian box by blocking off all other spawn points. And it might look like I've just enclosed that bed, but I haven't because corner blocks still count as a valid spawning space because it's, a, it's like a nice rectangle around the bed. Okay, and so the corner, it's in the corner... It's in the top right corner away from the door. And now I get out of here. And I test it. So we're going to go in here. We're going to jump. We're going to end up in the end. What the heck? Okay, this is fine. Yes, okay, this is fine. This is actually fine. Okay. Hello? Okay. My goodness, this is a mess. Are you kidding me? Seriously? You know what? I don't want to know. 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 Let's have this work. Yes! That baby! Oh, I can trap myself! Oh, goodness. Okay. Um... Okay, 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 so it'll work. Okay. Now let's kind of try and make this look less... Okay, if I'm going to wake up in here, then it should look a little bit nicer, because otherwise I will panic. 
Um, so that is the next priority. On to step 1.5, interior decorating, but not so much that I would escape. So I started decorating, but decorating is hard when you're trying to minimize escape chances because decorating generally involves blocks, and if you're putting in blocks, you're putting in more ways to escape. Uh, I even tried carpet for a bit, but as it turns out, that was a bad idea because you can stack carpet and climb it. After a while, though, I settled on something that I thought was pretty good, and I tested it, and I could not get out of it. I had corn-proofed it, and so I put all the stuff back the way I wanted it, and, well, that was step 1.5 done. Step two was to prepare a death trap for myself, which I think is pretty self-explanatory. And I've decided what I want, which is dripstone. Just, you know, quick, easy, done. And it also, it's something I can do myself if I set it up right, so Percy doesn't have to kill me, because I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to impose that upon him. That's just messed up. All right, so proof of concept one. If I stick this here, I can do that. It's going to, it's going to make the lever fall, but that's, that's not a problem. Proof of concept two. I can stand under here. I'm wearing all my armor. And get damaged. Okay, so now we're going to take proof of concept two and we're going to make proof of concept three, which is going to be that, but like really high up. So it'll build up more momentum and kill me. Now you might be thinking, Corn, what the heck happened? Um, you're covered in arrows. I thought you were building a death machine. Is your death machine covered in arrows? No, it's not. Because, okay. So for the death machine that I want to build, I need a lot of redstone because what I'm because it, because of the 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 what's he who's it the the flip the lever and the dripstone thing falls it requires like a redstone tower all the way up so that's a lot of redstone torches so I thought to myself okay I don't have a ton of redstone let's just go caving for it so I went caving and guess who got a bunch of redstone and is only now and also a diamond and is only now realizing that I could have just raided my old house so anyway we're gonna actually build it now and here we have it. A really long, just as I said, really long thing of redstone torches, which I can flip off here, but I'm not going to because, oh boy, was it hard to get that up there. Uh, but basically, there's a piston up there. Yeah, you can see the piston. It's going to push the block that has the dripstone on it. The dripstone's going to fall. It's going to hit here. Um, this isn't exactly something I can test. Well, like, I've tested that when I press the button, it falls, but it's a pain to reset. And it isn't something I can exactly test if it kills me because, like, it might kill me. So this is about as best as I can do for right now. Um, and I've sort of done everything. I've, I've prepared the room for when I die. I've, I've made my method of death. I guess now it's time for step three, getting Percy and doing it. Oh, that's a Gorn. Hey, Percy. Hey, Gorn. It's um, time. Okay. Don't that worry about it. That makes me feel a little You, you awkward. don't have to do anything. You don't have to do anything. I made sure of it. Is that what the big pillar is over there? Yeah, but don't worry about it, okay? I, it'll be fine. Um, and oh, one last thing before we like actually get started. Um, I can't seem to find Cat online, and I'm he needs to get certified. So if I lose my memories, it was in my Ender chest, and I would have forgotten about uh, okay. it. And yeah. so just uh, he, if you if you see he's, him, he's completely checked. Everything is fine. Completely checked, or completely checked okay. as of like three months ago when he completed his certification and. Then I haven't seen him since. Yeah, I'll put it in here. If I see him, I'll give you him. All right, but yeah. So it's it's all set up, hopefully. Um, to mm -hmm. be fair, I can't exactly test whether it works or whether I have found something that will trap myself, but I'm pretty sure it will. So if you... Do you want me to... Because basically, I'm having you in the in the lab to start with. It's a room off the lab. Um, so you don't have to see anything. You don't have to do anything. Um... So well, that makes it a that just makes it a lot more serious. I mean, it is still just death in Minecraft. I wouldn't have minded just giving a, a couple swipes. I didn't want to. I didn't want to make you do anything. You know, I didn't want to make you well, have to take part in it if you sweet. didn't want to. That's very sweet. Okay, I'll go to the lab then. Just message me when you're there. I'll go back and get ready. Put my stuff away. I'm yeah. gonna say goodbye to my kids. I'm gonna. You know, just let me know when you're ready. All right, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll miss you. All right. Well, this will be fun. See you in a bit. See you on the other side. <laughs> what am I doing? This is, this is, we want to be doing this. We want to be doing this. This is, this is important. We, we want to be doing this. We want to be doing this. This is going to get us answers. This is... Besides, you might not lose your memory, Corn. You, you're... 
It's just an experiment. You might not lose your memory. It doesn't matter that all of the other times you've died have, you know, memory loss associated with them. You might not lose your memory. And besides, is losing your memory such a bad thing? It's, it's not. It's really not. It's not. You've done it before. You can do it again. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna... Where? We're gonna put the bucket away. We're gonna put the food away. The bed's hidden so I can't break it. Because knowing me, I will break it to try and get out. Um... Let's just stick this in here. Yeah, why am I, why am I? Okay. Hey, Nessie. Hey, Freya. I love you. Um, I'll see you in a bit. It'll hopefully still be me.